On Tuesday at the 2016 U.S. Open, the men's quarterfinals start. I'm going to start with the top half, where there are three Frenchmen and world number one, Novak Djokovic. Novak Djokovic will take on his longtime rival, Joe Wilford Sanga. Djokovic has come into this tournament struggling a little bit with injury, his wrist and his forearm. He's been fortunate with the draw, getting one walkover and one retirement, but he's gotten better and better as the tournament has gone on. He looked very impressive in beating Kyle Edmund in straight sets. Joe Wilfred Sanga has looked very impressive, very explosive in beating Jack Sock in four sets to get to the quarterfinals. It's been a tough matchup against Novak Djokovic in the past few years, even though he has beaten him a couple of times. Sanga's going to need to be clicking with that serve and forehand in order to hit through the incredible Djokovic defense. The next quarterfinal will be the Battle of the Frenchmen. Gail Malfis, who's been so consistent in 2016, he's continued his excellent year. This summer, he won his first 500 event in D.C. at the City Open, saving match point in the final against Karlovic. Michael Tilstrom has done an excellent job managing his game, managing his offensive-defensive ratio, and there's no doubt that Malfis has showed increased maturity and mental focus in 2016. Malfis is going to have to get through his compatriot, who's having the tournament of his life, Lucas Puy, coming off a huge upset of former two-time U.S. Open champion Rafael Nadal, winning in a final set tiebreak. French tennis is having an incredible 2016 U.S. Open. Malfis and Puy will be battling it out for a spot in the semifinal.